connect your laptop using the provided USB cord or borrow a USB-C, USB-C cable from the service desk. Turn on the Rodecaster and turn multi-track recording on if you are recording each mic to a separate track. When recording in multi-track using Logic or other digital audio workstation software, you'll need to go to Preferences and check your audio input. Make sure Rodecaster Pro Multi-Channel is selected as the input. You will keep Rodecaster Pro Stereo as the output. For each track you create, you will select the input on the Rodecaster that you would like to record. The mics are inputs 3 to 6 in the software. Use this chart available on the Rode website. Create a stereo track with inputs 1 and 2 in the software to record all the inputs as one stereo track. This will be the only option if you have selected Rodecaster Stereo as your input. If you are using GarageBand, make sure to right-click the track and select Configure Track Header. Then select Record Enable. Press the record button on the track to test the levels and activate it for recording. You can adjust the levels by moving the fader for the input on the Rodecaster. To listen to your audio in the software through the headphones in the room, you'll need to check that your device audio settings have Rodecaster Stereo selected as the output. You'll need to move the USB slider up to hear the software audio output through the room's headphones. You can only record in stereo using Audacity. Remember to save your project when you are finished recording. For guides specific to each software, search for the software name in the Technology Supports page under Research Support on the Library webpage.